Hi, the other day I had been to a five-star hotel and having my dinner, I saw far away a group of affluent ladies were having their food too. Meanwhile, one cockroach from nowhere it flew and fell in a plate of a woman. Looking at the cockroach, the lady started screaming. She started, you know, throwing everything helter skelter, plates, glasses, spoon, fork, and in the process, the cockroach flew from her plate to some other lady's plate. And then she started creating a lot of hangama. From there, it went and you know flew and you know landed on the body of another woman. And there was total ruckus in the dining hall. Looking at the whole scenario, one waiter came closer to them, and this cockroach somehow it flew and then it landed uh, on the body of this waiter. The waiter looked at the cockroach for a while, and then slowly, slowly. He grabbed that cockroach and then threw that out of the window and out of the dining hall. Sitting there, I was observing. The cockroach was the same, and it did the same thing to this woman, to that woman, and with that waiter. But these two ladies created ruckus, and that waiter was so stable and so peaceful, and he was so calm. And how he could handle the situation? Then I understood what happens to us is only twenty percent. What we do to with what happens to us now that is eighty percent. What cockroach did was only little. The repercussions, the consequences, the reaction that these ladies did was the big thing in our life. Too many unexpected events would happen, and you you think that this will happen, but something else will happen. You expect some profits to make, but you encounter some losses. You think somebody will come and praise, and they will come and criticize you, and you think. That this how I am going to achieve this goal, but it won't happen. And when something that upsets you, the way you react, the way you scream, the way we get into depression is 80 percent, and we make our life hell. If only you know that this what happened, and with calm mind, with coolness, if you think that how to handle, if you can think, and I'm sure the problem is. A small thing, and you'll be able to handle it very well. So this is what the cockroach theory is all about. In our life, too, many cockroaches will come and land on us. So don't scream, don't jump, don't kill ruckus. Be a little calm, like the waiter, and see how can you handle that cockroach so that you can remain peaceful. And if you know this principle, I'm sure you will be very happy. Very peaceful. Nothing shall ever disturb you. So this is Squan Jaisema signing from Bhopal.